Hello, friends. Today's video is going to be showing some pictures of my garden throughout the summer and then a few of the crafts and drawings and things that I did over the summer as well. So let's first talk about the garden. So in my last video I showed the garden maybe, I think it was in June, and throughout the summer I've been taking pictures of all my flowers that were blooming and then all the vegetables that were growing and I think that my garden kind of kept me sane in the summer. So I really enjoyed the flower bed that had my sunflowers and zinnias growing in it and so did the bunnies. The bunnies were constantly around eating and we had baby bunnies in the garden again and this one baby bunny let me get pretty close to it. We also grew giant pumpkins this year and they got pretty big before the squash bugs started attacking them and by the time I realized what was happening it was too late. The next year we're going to try it again and make sure we spray for the squash bugs. And of course, my summer was spent with my kitties. They also kept me sane. In June, my grandma passed away and that kind of set the mood for the rest of the summer really. Um, I didn't really feel like doing a whole lot. So like I said, I didn't do a whole lot of drawing or painting this summer. I did make a um, craft where I bought this little wooden fence from the clearing section in Walmart. I spent $5 on it and I printed off a picture of one of the rabbits in the garden. I used Mod Podge and I kind of transferred the, the image on there. I've never done this before and it was an interesting experience. It was kind of maddening having to scrape all the paint, or not all the paint, but all the paper off to leave the image on there. And I wasn't even sure if I was doing it right, but I think it turned out pretty cute in the end. Here are a few of the drawings I did this summer. I also did a few prompts in my Create This Book. This is actually maybe in May when I did these and I just never uploaded them. Create Color Dispute. Draw a picture using all the wrong colors. So I went ahead and I drew a picture of a butterfly on some of the weeds that were in the yard. And I believe I haven't shown this before in a 
video, I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure I did it. Create a combo. Choose two of your favorite people, animals, or objects. Combine them. So I made Fun Gus in a video. It was a thrift store made video a few months ago. And he is a fungus. And he has mushrooms growing on his back. And I actually had him on my wall and my cat Loki knocked it off and broke some of the um, mushrooms on him. So I figured that would be kind of a cute drawing. So I have Jack and Boo um, who are playing baseball. And Boo knocked the ball into one of his mushrooms and broke it. And Fun Gus is crying. So I thought that was kind of fun. I also did a, a thrift store makeover, if you will. So my grandma, um, one year, gave me this little um, painting that you hang on the wall. And I decided that I wasn't really into what was on there. So I went ahead and I painted it. So I wanted to paint it with the bunnies because I'm kind of obsessed with the bunnies in my garden. And so I wanted to show a picture of them planting their own sunflowers since they love eating the sunflowers. I also took some of the pictures of the bunnies from my garden and turned them into stickers. This summer I also um, spent a lot of time putting together bouquets, so I picked a lot of the different flowers that I was growing in the garden and put them in vases. I even went to my first farmer's market and tried to sell a few of these. I didn't make very much money, but it was a neat experience. 